Hi guys, it's Chuma here, back with another video. And for today, I'm sharing with you guys this amazing sleek glow bun look that I do. It is definitely one of my signatures at this point. I have been thinking a lot about what I wanted to do for the look that was going to be our engagement shoot. And I was umming and ahhing, and you know what? I kept coming back to my sleek glow bun look because it just looks so sleek, of course. Looks so fabulous. I did this look for my my birthday um, back in December and I absolutely loved it so I thought you know what let me go ahead and try this one more time and actually film for you guys and here it is guys this is exactly how I go about creating this look so sit back and enjoy So I have prepped my hair offline and I had a wash day using the July Treasure Tress box, which was another amazing takeover, this time by Cream of Nature. So to cleanse, I used the Cream of Nature Aloe and Black Castor Oil shampoo. To deep condition, I used the Cream of Nature Aloe and Black Castor Oil hair mask. And then moved on to be able to moisturize my hair. I used the Cream of Nature Aloe and Back Castor Oil Reconstructing Anti-Breakage Leave-In. With this leave-in conditioner, I worked in sections. I applied the leave-in conditioner, then used the Rev Air to be able to stretch my hair. Once I was done, I then locked in that moisture with an oil. So for that, I used Afrocentric Seal, which is a moisture locking hair oil. And this particular combo, guys, worked absolutely amazingly this also meant that when I go into styling for my sleek bun I don't need to use any moisturizing product whatsoever I have literally done all of my prep the night before to get into the sleek bun look you guys know how I usually do this I'm going for a middle part this time for this particular look my olive oil eco styler never lets me down guys it never lets me down for this particular style ever in life it's a gem of a product and i use it every single time what i do is i make sure that my middle part is nice and straight you want a nice straight line if you're doing a middle part with this particular look so i go ahead and straighten out my middle part in line then all i do is apply the eco styler for this particular technique because i have my hair stretched i don't need to work in sections working in sections if my hair is stretched will only mean that my hair is prone to shrink once again and because my hair is stretched i can then put my hair all in one at the same time at the back so I can position the bun where I want it to be and then all I do is apply the eco styler over it to be able to give me that sleek look. To be able to complete the sleekness, I then go in with the Aunt Jackie's Curls and Coils Grapeseed Style and Shine Recipes. This is sleeked, it's a flexible styling glue, and when they say glue guys, they mean glue. I like using this glue because it's still moisturizing, but gives me the hold that I need, especially for my edges.
And then to finish and top it all off, I used the Aunt Jackie's Curls and Coils Grapeseed Style and Shine Recipes Frizz Patrol. Adding a setting mousse to this look is tested, it's proven, guys. It just makes sure that it gives your sleek look a solid hold. So on top of the gel, on top of the glue, the mousse just adds that extra little bit of hold that you will need. So to set everything in place basically, like setting mousse is exactly for that, it's setting. So that's what I go ahead and apply lastly to be able to finish. With this sleek look, it can be worn on the same day, but because of the amount of eco styler and edge control, unless you use a blow dryer or you have one of those home dryers that can dry your hair quickly, it does take a lot of time to be able to dry. So if you wear it out prematurely, you may find that your hair starts frizzing back up a bit and then you start getting those flyaways. So I always prefer to be able to do this style the night before I actually intend on wearing it out and it always works well for me. But yeah, if if you needed to wear it out the same day, then I recommend just putting your hair under one of those dryers or using a blow dryer to be able to quicken the process for you. I then grab my head scarf to be able to put that on my head and I'll leave this to dry overnight.
and that is me done guys i absolutely love 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 i hope you guys have enjoyed this video please do give it a thumbs up if you have also comment below let me know what you guys think and finally if this is the first time that you're joining me or you're returning and you haven't subscribed go ahead and hit that red button to subscribe also turn on the auto notification bell and that way you'll never miss a beat all right guys until next time bye